Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I want to appreciate you so much because of the love your continuity to support the work of this channel. If it was not you, we could have not reached this milestone that we are today. I'm so much humbled. I salute you. I salute you. Be blessed. Now, if you're a visitor and you have not subscribed to this channel, tafadali, subscribe. Just do me a favor. Just at a kamujaona reason. Even if you have not seen any reason to subscribe, just subscribe for no reason. Be blessed. Now, kumekucha. <laughs> Wa Kenya, I want to say it that the leadership that we, are, we have elected are going to represent us even outside Kenya. Now, the information that I'm receiving now and the details that are emerging is there is a meeting for deputy presidents across the world. And Kenya wametumiwa barua. <laughs> Kenya wametumiwa barua. And what we are expecting is that the current deputy president Rigathi Gashagwa to go and represent Kenya. And this meeting is going to be conducted in USA. And after that, I think William Ruto is also should travel. William Ruto also should travel. I think they have certain forum there, Sujin Forum Yanini. But it is very crucial. Mbichi kitajulikana. If sisi wa Kenya tulichagua viongozi ama psychophants. Something came into my mind. And I was just like, what a big mistake that we have made, we as Kenyans. I believe even today, even if Rigathi Gashagwa anaeda kuandikiwa speech, I know Rigathi Gashagwa, accordance to the Republic of Kenyans election, the world is respecting the democracy that Kenyans are having. So don't ask me a question that, how do you know that Rigathi Gashago is going to deliver a speech? Rigathi Gashago is going to deliver a speech. This is because Kenya is being listed among top five when it comes to the democracy in terms to elections. So I think Rigathi Gashago must go and uh, share the true moment about how we as Kenyans, we conduct our elections. How in terms, the government that Rigathi Gashagwa is in, they are going to cope up with this issue of high standard of living. In terms of high price of foodstuffs, in terms to uh, this issue of fertilizer, uh, in fact, in terms of uh, inputs when it comes to farm, let me generalize. Inputs when it comes to farming, in terms to petroleum, in terms also, why is it that Kenyans conduct a high price? What can I say? Maybe why Kenyans are conducting um, election with a huge price of resources? And that is why Rigathi Gashagwa must come out on board to explain to the world. So ladies and gentlemen, he is our leader. He is the deputy president of the Republic of Kenya. Then you expect Rigathi Gashagwa to come out with a good speech to go and represent Kenya in USA. <laughs> Mark my words. I want to tell you the truth. Rigathi Gashagwa, if it was William Ruto still the deputy president, it was okay because William Ruto also attended that forum. Do you remember? And also Ruto attended the house what? It's called what? Kuna house something. William Samruto was in US. Then he went to London. And William Samruto, when it comes to presenting himself, he presented him extremely well the question that we are asking we as kenyans 
Is Rigathi Gachogo going to represent Kenyans as per what we are expecting? Because even yesterday, day, when there was inauguration ceremony where they were taking on, Rigathi Gachagua moved out of the lane that Kenyans were expecting him to address. But in, uh, instead of addressing certain issues that were important, Rigathi Gachagua went back to the politics. Oh, DCI Walitumika, oh, judges, eh, Supreme Court Walitumika, or oh, IBC Walitumika, or oh, we are having freedom of... I mean, Rigathi Gachagua. Is this man going to represent Kenya as we expect? Because he expected to address Kenyans. So the meeting, I don't know, the meeting is likely to happen after William Samuruto, uh, is going to um, uh, is going to attend a certain meeting in the US, which according to me I don't know. I think William Ruto is also having a meeting with the president of Somalia, and uh, is going to have a meeting with the president of Uganda, and uh, is going to travel to Tanzania within that short period of time to know how these countries are. Then after that. I think regarding the, the conference is scheduled next month. Yes, according to the information that we are receiving. But I want to ask a question, ladies and gentlemen. I imagine that William Samuruto is going outside the country for certain diplomatic meeting. I imagine how regarding Gashagwa is going to act as maybe a person as a deputy president that has been left in the office to at least oversee whatever is happening. If anything is going to happen, then he can report to the president that is outside the country. I imagine that picture. How Rigadi Gashago is going to act, maybe as acting president. Number two, I imagine how Rigadi Gashago is going to behave traveling outside the country for certain diplomatic meeting where the deputy president of the Republic of Kenya, together with other deputy president of the other Republic of Kenya, are expected to attend those meetings, then something is coming to my mind. If Rigadi Gashagwa came out very clear yesterday, powerful, do you know that even those presidents that were invited in that ceremony I know they ask themselves, is William Samuruto having a co-president? Because he came out very elaborate. Then you must ask yourself a question. Do you mean that other countries, they don't have vice president? They don't have deputy president? Who knows the vice president of Tanzania? Who knows the vice president of Uganda? Who knows the vice president of Rwanda, Burundi? Who knows that? But we as Kenyans, we know the deputy president of 2013 to 2017 was William Samaruto. In fact, he was Ali uh, Julikana Duniamzima. Yes? In terms to regarding uh, Gashagwa, Anaenda Kujulikana because of certain issues that are going to come. So, ladies and gentlemen, what are your thoughts? Drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, I want to appreciate you so much because of your great support. If you are a visitor, please do me a favor. Ensure that you hit that subscription button that when I upload my uh, and also don't forget to put on that notification bell that when I upload my videos you get notified for those who are returning subscribers thank you so much bye bye